that prosthetic is missing. So if anyone knows where it is. It's at his house. That was my favorite scene on paper, for sure, when I first read it. And I thought, how lucky is this guy to get a new one, bigger and better? I read it wrong. I read it way less exaggerated. I didn't think of it as like the, the climax of the film. It was very important to me that Lisa would take the dismembered penis from one guy and sew it onto another guy. That was like an important scene that I needed to happen. I think we were trying to ride the line between how much of a gentleman is Creature in this, what could be quite an erotic sequence, uh, and how much does he want to sort of break the etiquette of where he came from to sort of enjoy himself that was so in the cute. moment. Yeah. Um, I feel like that was kind of improv, right? That decision. Yeah. I think, that wasn't yeah. written that way, that, yeah. you know, Creature was shy or anything. That was a good choice, I think. I think we tried to play as much of that as possible. It's like how much he wants to actually be part of this romantic experience. I think a theme in this movie is that the creature is just fully at her service and completely devoted to her. And so he doesn't like to see her hurt. He's very jealous of Michael Trent, and so he just does what he feels he needs to do. Oh, I openly talk about how this is one of the scenes that when we were pitching the movie, I would so energetically pitch. And funny enough, I was the one pitching the penis on the day as well, because it was <laughs> not flying in the way I wanted it to. So I was one of the people throwing it which is such a delight that that's my job. That prosthetic is missing. So if anyone knows where it is. It's at his house. It's not at okay. my house. It's not at my house. Someone someone took it. Someone has the prize possession. Yeah, whoever took it. If we see it. it on eBay, I'm just letting you know, we know. We know that you took it. They did they find it. it. They have now found it, but it took a while. And he and I were ready to go and make a documentary and try and find it. <laughs> I was so prepared and then they found it. So unfortunately the documentary is not to be.